New website and business owners oftentimes get confused by tools like Google Analytics and Google Search Console, which was previously called Google Webmaster Tools. In fact, you know what? Many times these different tools and services are confused for one another or with one another, really, I should say. So here, what we'll do is we'll break them down and detail them out so that you can better understand what each one does and if you'd like to use them for yourself, for your own website and in your own online business. Okay, let's start off with some good news. First, both Google Analytics and Google Search Console are free. <laughs> they are free tools that you and I and everybody else can use for our websites and for our online businesses. However, they are both completely different tools that provide very different services and information about your website and for your website. So first, let's talk about Google Analytics. If you don't already know, Google Analytics is a free service that allows you to track visitor behavior and activity on your website. So this includes things like the number of visitors that are landing on your website and on your specific pages. You can get all kinds of different types of information like periods of time, based on the day, the week, the month, the year, and so on. Number of page views, number of unique visitors, number of pages per session, bounce rates, session duration, traffic sources, the geographic location of your website's visitors, what they were wearing when they came to your website. Well, maybe not quite, but all kinds of this sort of visitor information, which is crucial for us website and online business owners to know. All right. Now, what's great about Google Analytics, too, is that for regular users who simply want a broad overview of their website and of their visitor behavior, you know, if you aren't really a data junkie, you just kind of want the broad overview, then what you can do is you can stick with the fairly intuitive dashboard interface and just kind of get a broad overview of what's happening and what's going on on your website. However, that said, for data and analytics junkies, you can dig much, much deeper into Google Analytics and gain tons and tons of in-depth info and data, things like goals and funnels and a whole heck of a lot more. Now, I should say too that it's important to note that in order to use Google Analytics, you're first going to have to set it up with your website, but thankfully that is a one-time process and it really isn't all that difficult. Okay, next let's address Google Search Console. What Google Search Console does specifically is it helps us website owners and online business owners manage our website and our web pages as they appear in Google Search. So, for instance, with Google Search Console, you can check the indexing status of specific web pages and see how they're ranking and what keywords they're ranking for but it does not stop here. What's super awesome is that Google Search Console comes packed with a few other really awesome features, really actually more than a few. So for instance, Google Search Console will list all of the external web pages that link to your website. This is called backlinks in SEO lingo. Furthermore, you can submit a sitemap for your website to ensure that Google crawls and indexes all the pages on your website. What's really super awesome too is that Google Search Console will also report to you and list out any errors or security issues that it finds on your website so that folks like us can go and rapidly fix them. What's great too is just like Google Analytics, Google Search Console is free to use. But once again, you'll have to make sure to connect your website up to Google Search Console, the Google Search Console service first to ensure that it tracks your website properly. 
All right, now I'm sure there are still a ton of questions on your mind, and really we've only just kind of scratched the surface here. There's still lots more to go, and you and I can continue in much more depth and in much more detail over at 10tononline.com forward slash traffic. What you'll find there is a free audience attraction boot camp, a self paced online course that runs about an hour or so where you and I take all of this much, much further. I know you're going to love it. So grab yourself a coffee, grab your notepad and a pen, and I will see you there.